Well, good morning. This is Ralph, W5VE, Whiskey 5 Victor Echo, here in Alexander, North Carolina. And we're working a little FT4. I just thought I'd show you guys what it looks like. I know uh, you guys on the uh, uh, FT4 Facebook page know already, but you might get a tip from this, or you might be able to tell me what I'm doing wrong. I'm... Uh, listing right now to 20 meters ft4 and i've worked uh i don't know nine or ten already it's like eating salted peanuts you can't eat just one <laughs> you gotta keep going so i'm gonna turn this around so you can see my screens and so forth icom 7200 I have a uh, 43 foot vertical with 3,000 feet of radio wires, wire AA5ZY. And he's in, if I look over my logbook, Canton, Texas. Uh, okay, very good. Now let's see what else is happening. There is a. Uh, well, I've worked on the guys in gray. This comes from JT Alert. The guys in gray, I've already worked. There was a Cuban station. Let's see there. Let's try the guy in Cuba. Cuba Libre. Viva Cuba. Well, he's not coming back. I'll give him another couple of tries. I don't want to try too long on these guys unless like up here i just walked away and forgot it was still on <laughs> it's embarrassing oh there he comes so i got the guy in cuba i gave him a plus a minus five he gave me a minus four that's very good i'm located here in the mountains of western north carolina so it's pretty easy to get to cuba okay now we want to log him so I click there and it appears in my log. It's already appeared in my log over here. Santiago de Cuba. Okay, good. Now I look for the next one. That's how feist FT4 is. You got to be on the ball. Ooh, ZD7BG. That's St. Helena Island. I don't have it overall, although I've worked it before. This guy, I believe it's the same guy I've worked before. He only takes uh, cards direct, so i got to send him one in the mail. But not for this QSO, because he's not coming back to me. Oh, I need to put my preamp on the receiver. Okay. Maybe that will help me decode him. Okay, that's about enough. I guess I'm not getting him right now. I can tell when I'm not getting out as well as I should be on uh, on 40 meters. I mean on 20 meters. And I assume it's the difference in the vertical antenna versus a lot of people running horizontal. But I'm I'm making my good share of my own share of contacts. W0ERB, I'm looking at you. Eldon in Manhattan, Kansas. Oh, he's looking back at me. Good. And of course we have the necessary fuel. And there we have the contact made already. I'm using the uh, little Osmos, Osmo Pocket uh, camera from DJI, the people who are the leading drone manufacturer in the world. It's got a three-axis gimbal on it, so it stays pretty smooth. I'm just holding it in my hand. I couldn't be bothered to go get a, uh, a tripod for it, although I have one with the correct holder. So he's... Uh, 
in the log. I usually log when I have 10 or so. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So, because logging is so easy, you know, why make people wait for a confirmation? So, I'm going to select this and I gotta move down and hit the uh, shift key. Oops, hold down the shift key and pull this down. Sorry. I can go to uh, that one. All right, and then just tell it F T L O T W upload. Click and it's finished. It's that simple. Now all these will change to yes. All these will change to there. You go. Good. So I just uploaded. Uh, 10 more to uh, LOTW, and while I'm doing that, I'm calling W0PEC. He's in Minnesota. And then I can refresh in my LOTW and see who out of that batch is confirmed already, if anyone. I got 19,271 QSLs confirmed through LOTW. That's pretty good. Okay, I'm not getting W0PEC, so when this call ends, I'm going to halt the transmission. Let's see, there's Denmark, OZ. No, that. Yeah, OZ is Denmark, sorry. OX is Greenland. OY is the Faroe Islands. Those are the Danish calls. I wonder if by some stretch of fantasy uh, we do by Greenland what the new what the call sign will be. Because then they would need a US call. I don't really foresee that happening, but it's interesting to ponder upon it. Well, I'm not seeing uh, much becoming available here. I got a lot of gray ones because I've worked a lot of uh, FT4, several hundred at least on uh, 20 meters already. Of course, I have uh, JT Alert up here, so I can check and see what's oops, what's going on. The the yellow uh, column now is for uh, FT4, and the majority of the uh, activity right now is on 20 meters, which I'm on. Uh, there's an Italian station, but I've already worked them. Well, the guy in Denmark is a minus two. I might have a chance of getting him. Yep, how about that? First call, Denmark. And he gave me an R73. I wait before I hit to log it until it finishes transmitting because ever since uh, WJTX 2.1 came out, if you hit the log too soon, for some reason it causes your transmitter to start transmitting on, pick out someone else and start transmitting to them. So you don't get your 73 through to the guy you just worked. 
and and you're sometimes intruding on somebody in a QSO, which is not nice to do. There's a VA3SBA. Give him a shot. Oh, he came back, yes. Of course he came back. I transmitted. <laughs> That's not always true, by the way. As you know, you've seen on the uh, film here. I'm, uh, I started telling you about the uh, Osmo Pocket with the uh, three-axis gimbal. It's the best thing since sliced bread. Okay, he's in the log. VA3SB, thank you, sir. And uh, it actually, I'm actually shooting at uh, 4K, 24 frames per second, which is professional video standard. Uh, movies are made at that quite often now, although they're going even higher in resolution these days. But it's incredible that a camera that costs $350, but that it can shoot... Uh, video that's ready with a little editing to go on national TV, for example. Certainly it looks good on YouTube. Uh, my eagle eyes are looking for something different or something new that I haven't got yet. I am uh, avidly watching W7s and W4s now. Because the only thing I need for WAS on FT4 are South Carolina and Wyoming. I'm looking for you guys, guys, or ladies. And I will eventually get them because I get, I get stuff. My goal is to have WAS on every band from 160 to 6 meters. And I actually have WAS on every band from, and this is all within the last two years since uh, uh, FT8 came along, really up my scores. But I currently have every band from 160 to 15 meters, including 60 meters. I've got 50 states confirmed on 6 meters, although the AWRL does not offer a WAS for it on that. And I could go into why, but it would take a while. They have a valid reason. And on, uh, I only need three states on 12. One state, I'm looking for you, Alaska, on 10 meters, which will give me 5-band WAS. And I need eight states on six meters, and then I'll have a clean sweep and, uh, of uh, WAS on everything from, I'd let that drift up, on everything from 160 to 6, including 60 meters. So that's what I want. I'm also working on DX, but I only have DX, I think, on five bands so far. Getting close on other bands. Oops, that was a W W three K N. Well, I try K two I W. But W three K M was calling C Q, and I just wasn't fast enough because it was running my mouth. I love my little uh, seventy two hundred. It does a great job. Yes, sir. Oh, K2IW came back to him. In fact, the, I missed that whole QSO almost. Of course, this stays on until I tell it to log. So we'll look here and hit log, and bingo, he is in the log. And I'll confirm him on LOTW shortly. Now, I'm going to get maybe one more and then end this video, but I hope you got something out of it and see how easy it is to work FT4. And get lots of contacts in a short time and enjoy doing it.
da, da, da. no, there's another Italian station. I worked him earlier today. Hope the audio came out well. I'm using an external lavalier mic microphone clipped on my shirt like they do uh, on TV when they're interviewing people. Makes better audio. Wow, well, come on, come on, come on. W1KMA sent CQ. He's working a guy in the Netherlands, but he may not be calling CQ. But speaking of WAS, up here on the wall, that's my 160 meter WAS. I'm rather proud of that. That took some getting to get. And if we look over on the office door here, there are several other WAS awards. I, I don't get them all. I got like 20 or 30 WAS awards. The, uh, the AWRL offers a lot of them. And I don't buy every one because I don't care about getting a little sticker to put on. Like if you work 80 meters WAS, they send you a sticker to put on the uh, your uh, mixed or phone or whatever WAS. And they're seventeen dollars. So I don't often always get them, although I've gotten a lot. I support the AWRL. A R. Yeah, A W R L A R R L. Anyway, they're good guys and gals. Okay, one more here. K D two N O M. He's minus twelve. I have a pretty good chance of getting him. Or not. I didn't even hear decode him coming back. Uh, I can look up here on my uh, waterfall. Yeah, I'm not seeing much of a signal in there. Huh. But the heck with that, he came back. That's uh, uh, Mark in Monroe Town. New Jersey. Okay. Let me turn this back around. All I have to do is hit one little button on there and it's back on me. Hi there, guys. So I hope you've enjoyed this. I got my computer glasses on. Uh, they so I look a little different than when I have my regular devices. But I hope you've enjoyed this. This is W five V E seventy three from Alexander, North Carolina. And those of you that live within the same galaxy as Shelby, North Carolina, uh, this weekend coming up, we have the Shelby Ham Fest, which is the second largest ham fest in the U.S. I will be there. As you may guess from my call, W5 Volunteer Examiner, I will be there uh, giving tests, helping out the uh, RVEC and 4NH. And uh, uh, I do that every year, and we usually wind up making quite a few new hounds to so study up and come take your test. Meanwhile, enjoy the ham fest. There's usually, I don't know, 15, 20,000 people there. It's huge and hot always hot but it's very very enjoyable and i'll go through the flea market and probably come out with some goodies and uh just have a great time see a lot a lot of you guys if you see me 
come up and shake hands. I'll be wearing a cap that's with big call letters on it, W5VE, and I'll have a badge on my shirt too. Be glad to see you and shake your hand. Again, 73, W5VE is clear this channel. Really. Honest. Where's the button? There it is.